let's take a look at three important kinds of productivity. Two common measures of productivity are partial productivity and multi-factor productivity. Partial productivity indicates how much of a particular kind of input it takes to produce an output. Labor is one kind of input that is frequently used when determining partial productivity. Labor productivity typically indicates the cost or number of hours of labor it takes to produce an output. Multi-factor productivity is an overall measure of productivity that assesses how efficiently companies use all the inputs it takes to make outputs. More specifically, multi-factor productivity indicates how much labor, capital, materials, and energy it takes to produce an output. Should managers use multiple or partial productivity measures? In general, they should use both. Multi-factor productivity indicates a company's overall level of productivity relative to its competitors. In the end, that's what counts most. However, multi-factor productivity measures don't indicate the specific contributions that labor, capital, materials, or energies make to overall productivity. To analyze the contributions of these individual components, managers need to use partial productivity measures. Doing so can help them determine what factors need to be adjusted or what areas of adjustment can make the most difference in overall productivity.